Hey, how you doing? Welcome to Unboxing with Marty. We got a special treat here. We're going to take a look at the uh, Cosmic Alpha 7 on the Pop OS 24.04 LTS Alpha. This is where you go to get the uh, Cosmic Alpha 7 release. Now, a little background. This is supposed to be the last release before the beta period. It was released around uh, late April of 25. So, uh, as in all my videos about Linux distros, always go to the homepage, read up a little bit, get to know it. Uh, so what we're going to do is let's move through and do a high-level test drive of this Linux distro. Okay, what I want to do is I want to go through some of these uh, apps right here. It's a good place to start. We're going to first start off with a launcher. This is kind of nice. So it's kind of like a, a search app. So, for example, let's just uh, search Writer. Oh, look at that, LibreOffice. Just with that, it comes up. So I want you to uh, see this little icon, this little symbol here. You notice this? Okay, it's going to change after I open it up. So let's take a look. Just a little FYI, a little information. Here we go. Now let's go back, and we're going to, again, search for writer. What? Don't even have to search for it. You can see it right here. You see, now it's uh, indicating that it's an open window. So that's something to look at. So use the launcher to help you find apps on this uh, distro. All right, let's have a look at this. This is pretty exciting. This is a lot. This is what a lot of the buzz is about. This uh, this show here is. It's called. You can see as I hover over, it gives you the name. Workspaces, kind of nice there. So what we want to do here is, you know what? I'm going to open uh, several apps. Let's just go with uh, files. We're going to open that up, and then let's open up. Let's try. You know what? We'll go with the uh, Cosmic Text Editor. Let's open that up. And what else? You know what? Let's go with terminal, just so we can get something loaded up there. There you go. So we've got three here. What's cool about this is if you go over here and you click on workspace, you can see the workspaces show up there. What we can do is let's drag and drop. As you can see, we're working through these uh, workspaces. Now, an easy way to navigate through here is, well, what we're going to do is we're going to use the super key uh, on those window keys board. It's the... Um, Windows key, we're gonna hold down the Windows key and you're gonna arrow down, arrow up, you get it, you get the idea. But uh, what's really kind of cool about this is let's click here, clear that little workspace here on the side. And again, hold down the super key, the window key, and you can arrow down and arrow up. You can see how you can navigate through your workspaces. Kind of cool, isn't it? Uh, you know what we wanna do is, well, while we're here is we're gonna to go to, well, you know what, let's open this up, got it. And then we're gonna to go to settings. And uh, we're going to go to desktop. And then I want to go to workspaces. We'll find it right here. See right here, workspaces. We're going to open that up. And you see here, workspaces orientation. Now, like I said, see right here. Got it. You see how they're vertical. What we're going to do is we're going to change it. We're going to go to horizontal. Watch this. Now they're across the top here. So you can still use the uh, super key, the Windows key. But you can't, uh, you don't want to arrow up and down, but you can arrow left and right. Got that? Nice. So again, if we click here, uh, let's go back to, yeah, let's just do this. We're going to arrow left and right. Got it? See, now that's how you navigate. So now we're doing a, a horizontal rather than a vertical. So just for this video, I'm going to return it back. And there we go. And that's just a quick uh, look at the uh, workspaces. Again, that's a pretty hot item right now. That's what a lot of buzz is about on this distro. So let's go on to something else. Uh, you know what we want to do is we're going to take a look at the super key and we're going to try some of these super key combos. So first, like we learned earlier, if you hit the super key, Windows key, brings up your uh, launcher. Let's close that out. Let's take a look. You'd use the super key, window key, and use with the letter T. Brings up the terminal. Now, if you want to close it out, you can hit that Windows key, super key, and hit the letter Q. Closes it out. Super key with the letter B. Brings up the uh, browser. That'll be up in a minute. There you go. Let's try something a little bit different here. Let's uh, hit the super key with the letter M for maximize. There you go. And then we're going to hit that Windows key with the letter M again. We're going to shrink it down. Nice, right? And we're going to close it out. Windows key, Q. And we're closed out. Uh, let's see. And then if we hit the, uh, well, let's go with the Windows key and the escape key. Locks the uh, device up. Kind of nice. So now I'm going to uh, log back in. Hold on. Okay, what I want to look at next is let's just take a look at the applications. We're going to pop this open. You can see it's got some categories here already. Looks like you can add a group. Uh, we're not going to do that for this video. We're just going to take a look at what they give you. Oh, by the way, if you're enjoying this video and the videos on this channel, 
uh, it be, might be a great time to hit that subscribe button. You know, when you subscribe to this channel, you are helping this channel grow, and it is appreciated. And like I've said before, likes are good. Comments are always uh, encouraged. So again, we just kind of went through the uh, library home. Let's take a look at the office. You can see there are some office suites. Some of you will recognize the Libra office suite. Kind of nice there. Got some system apps here, just to give you an idea of what's available. And then we'll hit on the utilities. You get an idea there. That's kind of cool too. So let's move on to another topic. All right, you know what we want to do is we're going to take a look at the cosmic settings. You can just hover the mouse over. You can see it right there. So we're going to open this up. Uh, I think it's kind of cool that they have this accessibility section. Um, here it's kind of nice because you can see here you can adjust for vision. So, uh, for example, uh, you got eye contrast mode. Kind of nice, right? And you can invert colors and color filters. You get it. Uh, you can play the stereo audio as mono. Kind of nice if you need that, if you're more comfortable with it. Uh, let's take a look. Next, we're going to look at the desktop. This is where I have a lot of the fun here is the uh, wallpaper. Here's your choices. You can go through here. You can see, yeah, they get you started with some wallpaper there. It's kind of nice. We're going to back out of here. Let's look at appearance. Kind of nice. See, you got this. You can go dark, light. You get the idea. Uh, so here you got the round. You can kind of see how it's round down here. And we'll go over here to square. See, now it's squared off. There's something for you to look at. Uh, let's uh, back out of here. And then let's look at the panel. This is kind of nice. Let's take a look at the panel. That's up here. So we're going to go ahead and just open this up a bit. Uh, you know, uh, what we can do is we can turn this off. I kind of like this. This is kind of interesting for me, but uh, I'm going to return it to where it was originally. Uh, again, you can go through here and work on the panel. Uh, let's back it out a little bit and let's take a look at the dock. That's this down here. So we're going to hit here. Uh, again, uh, if you want to extend the dock to screen edges, just click here. And now you got this full thing going here. Uh, it's kind of nice just to give you an idea. So there's plenty of settings in here to play with. Uh, let's go out. Let's bounce out of here. And then let's go to Windows Management. Let's take a look at it here. Uh, you can take a look. There's some of the options here with Window Management. You can uh, like uh, the super key action. It'll open the launcher. So yeah, so if I hit the Windows key, launches it. Just get it. All right. So that's one of the settings you can play with there. Uh, let's see what else we got here. Let's uh, back out of here. Workspaces. We looked at this earlier, but we'll just pop it open again. You get the idea. You know, you can change the workspaces here. Uh, let's, again, just kind of repeat, but yes, we can do that. You get it. All right, so now vertical. Let's change it to horizontal. There you go. You got the horizontal. So then we're going to just return it back. So that is a quick view of the uh, cosmic settings and what i think we want to do finally to conclude this video is to have a look at the cosmic store right here this is your app store this is where you get the apps you want to download so let's take a look uh, you got some here to look at we're just going to thumb through here real quick just to give you an idea plenty here to pick from but uh, that gives you a pretty good idea of this uh, cosmic alpha 7 on the pop os 24.04 lts uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed this video and the videos on this channel, please be sure to hit that like and subscribe button. And until the next video, I want to thank you for watching and have a good day.